Hey YouTube, welcome back to the channel. Today we're back with another cash game session playing 1-2 with a $200 buy-in. Here we raise fours, get a couple calls. 10 4 3 I'm gonna go ahead and check here. Not a good turn card. Still betting turn though. Two calls, ah, river. I think we still go for value here on the river. If I got raised by the bigger stack, I'd probably fold, but uh, probably lose to a flush, but we're getting 17 to 1 here. Flush, yeah. All right, own ourselves there at the fours. This is a four bet here. So once we do this, it would be have to stack off against the cold caller, but they're, they play 56% of hands, so we would be if they get it in. Mainly, this is a bluff against Thought Riot. So I see the call. Half pot behind. Usually these are spots where if I check, I feel like people over bluff the turn. So I'm gonna actually check this back. Six on the turn. Oh, that sucks. We chop with Asex, we we're beating. Um River, yeah, I'm gonna try to do the same thing, give him a chance to bluff. And if they check, obviously just jamming now for half pot. See the call of Queens. Wow, we got lucky. <laughs> we got really lucky. I was wrong about their range. Button open, we three back get called. We'll check the queen 10 6 here, two hearts. Uh, check call here. Turn three, check. That's again, call again. And five over check. Uh, we do block both queen jack suited. Uh, let's see. Um, do I call here? I think we're going to. And set of sixes. No good. Playing heads up, button opens. We three bet king four suited, get called. I'm going to go ahead and check top pair. King ten nine, two clubs. Uh, goes for half pot call. Not a good turn card. That's again, still calling one more, but not thrilled here. And six over check. Feels sick folding top pair, but I think if this two is not a club, I would call, but. Um, if he finds the triple barrel, I mean, heads up, I'm probably supposed to call this. Uh, that's why I don't play much heads up because I'm not studied in it at all. Uh, all right, I'm gonna full, but call if this is a five or a three, where at least like seven, eight misses. There's some other straight draws I miss though. This may be way too tight. Heads up, I don't know. They're like good hands, but can be hard to navigate at times. So we flop top two with Ace Queen, though, after we have three bet. Turn King. Uh, check Jam or just bet here. I'm just going to go ahead and bet. And then Nine River Jam for value, I think, is played. Two flush draws missing. Hope they call with like ace 10, ace jack, ace 5, ace 4 stuff here with two flush draws missing. So jam river. Hopefully it's king queen. That'd be great too. But we just jam. They fold. All right. So king queen suited here. I'm going to go ahead and flat. This is open two calls. Squeeze. And we flopped the nuts. Nice. Ace jack 10. Um, I think I'm just going to call here. Six in the turn. So turn in position could go either way. Um, don't want to see a spade. Don't want to see board pair. Obviously, a king or queen counterfeiting or two pair would kind of stink. So I'm just going to call here. Uh, don't love the spades, but we're obviously not folding. If they jam, if they check here, I would be jamming. I wouldn't expect them to check spades. So we'd start targeting like their sets here aces, jacks, maybe tens if they squeeze that multi way. In small bet, I'm going to jam for value. So we're going to go for the value jam. Please don't snap me. <laughs> I, think, I think we can get, if they can maybe level themselves just enough here with the set. So hopefully they have a set of aces or a set of jacks. Or east jack. Yep, same type of idea. So pretty fortunate there. Uh, here on the turn, this is kind of a weird one. So they lead into us for pot on the turn after we bat and get two calls. Given their stacks, I'm just going to effectively put them in. 
as queen ten of spades. We got sixty five percent. Ah, lose the eight on the river. No good against the combo draw. All right, go for the squeeze here. So this is cut off open, a button flat. We squeeze. See the four bets. Um, gonna be jamming some here. Let me go for it this time. And see the fold. Nice jam gets through. Cold four bet here. So we see just a call. Now if the cutoff jams, now it would call because this is gonna be a hand that's probably never has us crushed. Never be aces or kings. Uh, so I'm gonna check multi way on the king king eight. Opposition to two people. Obviously, just don't want to see diamonds really. Don't want to see it eight either because I want to chop like king queen king jack. But uh, checks through. Go ahead and bet turn. I uh, prefer to see like ten nine and jack ten stuff in this here too on the river. Four river. Uh, they could have six five, but I think that's played pretty clear jam here, hoping they have like a king queen king jack that could still have themselves. Or they might just have queens. Flatting pre, maybe. Jax just doesn't believe me. So we'll jam for value here. Snap folds, we take it down. All right, 08 7 suited, three bets, call, bottom pair, and a few backdoors here. Both sizes setting up for a check call. So go small, we call. Turn a massive combo draw. So I'm less likely to jam on double flush draw. But I think I might still do it here, actually. Oh, if they bet turd, just because there's like less folds. Um, I mean, we gotta have some bluff jams. This one makes sense. The one that doesn't check raise flop. All right, I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna jam here. I don't know if I love this, guys. I like it a lot more if there's only one flusher out there. But I guess if he calls with like ace king of diamonds, we're ahead actually. So all right, we'll jam. And eventually, see if we'll take it down. We're gonna be betting flop after we open. So we flop the flush draw here in King 10 6. Check raises. Uh, I think we'll call it the flush draw. In position here. Ace on the turn. Kind of an interesting turn card. We do block the straight here. Checks. So. I'm gonna go ahead and bet turn. I'm not supposed to bluff a lot of hearts on River, but I think the Queen or the Jack we can. I think it's probably okay. Even puts a hand like King 10 in a tough spot by the river. Getting double check raise would really suck here. And then, like I said, I think we're going to use this as our bluff. Trying to make even like a flopped King 10, King 6 to fold here. 10 6. So we're going to be all in. Of the heart draws, like I said, I would only want to do this if we have the Queen or the Jack. Ugh, calls last night with King 10. Nice call. Nice call. Tried to run the bluff. Doesn't work. So open ace queen suited flat squeeze. We're gonna call here and flop the ace high flush draw. All right. So do we raise or just call against bets? Probably depends on the size. If they go big, we actually probably can just jam. Um, I think yeah. If they go half or bigger, we're just gonna jam. And if they go small, we'll just call. That's gonna be the plan. So third call, half pot bigger jam. So yeah, they go twenty seven. If we call, it's like one ten effective, one forty four back. So yeah, I'm just gonna rip it here. Calling's probably fine too, but we'll go for jam. And you see the fold take it down. So cut off first button run of four bet queens. Okay, four bet call, eight five two, go for the bet here. Get jammed on, alright. Queens tens, hold. Hold it up. Nice, good hold with queens there. All right, open eight six suited, big blind defense, few back doors here. We'll go for half pot and flop. Uh, seven turn. We're gonna go ahead and over bet turn. Balls deuce river. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna run this one. And see the fold bluff gets through. All right, YouTube, that wraps up an eight-hour cash game session, and we do book a win here today. So we played 3,512 hands plus 376. So much more steady session compared to the last one you guys saw. So 
Hope you enjoyed today's video and the hands. If you did, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And if you ever want to catch the live streams on Twitch, I have a link to my Twitch channel in the description below.